Even 10 years after the start of production, the Mazda CX-7 has not lost its visual appeal. And given the low cost, many may think about replacing the sedan with a crossover with a sports bias. But there are a couple of pitfalls to be aware of before buying. Perhaps the low price of the Mazda CX-7 was not formed in vain? Below in the article you will get the answer to this question. By the age of 10, there are still no frankly rotten Mazda CX-7s, but there are foci in places of chips or other damage. If the car has not yet been treated with anti-corrosive, then you should definitely do it, especially the bottom and lower part of the doors. The hood and front fenders can be protected with a special armored film. The corrosion resistance of the metal and the quality of the paintwork of Japanese cars are traditionally at an average level. But with the complete set of the Mazda CX-7 everything is in order. Already in the base there is climate control and six airbags. A leather interior and high quality Bose music is found in 9 out of 10 cars. Before restyling, a monitor with a touchscreen and a rear view camera was installed only on cars for the American market. After 2009, the CX-7 was enriched with premium Bose surround sound music, auto folding mirrors, and an LCA blind spot monitoring system. Virtually no options, one and only petrol 2.3 turbo. Timid attempts to add a sluggish atmospheric gasoline 2.5 liter to the range. Were unsuccessful. A 173 horsepower 2.2 liter turbo diesel can be classified as exotic. Finding a Mazda CX-7 with the last two engines on the secondary market is very difficult. Therefore, we will talk about the famous turbocharged 2.3 liter, which was borrowed from the Mazda 6 MPS the motor rides well even with the weight of the crossover. But there was a problem with reliability. Areas of concern, turbine, according to the reviews of the owners of the Mazda CX-7, it dies suddenly and often. But in fact, most often this is preceded by improper operation of the turbocharged engine and poor quality service. Timing chain can stretch for 50,000 runs. Coupling VVTI. The first sign is a crackling sound when starting the engine, in the later stages a diesel sound of the engine. If you ignore this problem, then an expensive overhaul is guaranteed. Before buying, be sure to listen to the engine in a quiet place. It should run smoothly and without any metallic sounds. White smoke from the exhaust pipe at idle means an early death of the turbine. It is preferable to choose a used CX-7 with a turbo timer. This at least means that the previous owner thought about the proper operation of the car. If you bought a Mazda CX-7 and don't know if you changed the oil supply pipe to the turbine, then be sure to change it. It is not so expensive, but it can protect against premature failure of the turbine. When using low quality oil or changing it rarely, the tube cokes and then comes suddenly from the first item in the list of problem areas. For a 2.3 engine, the consumption rate of engine oil is up to 1 liter per 10,000 kilometers, but, unfortunately, you will find out the real expense only after the purchase. According to the reviews of the owners of the Mazda CX-7, sharp oil losses are possible without the sensor being triggered. Therefore, it is recommended to regularly, manually check the required oil level in the engine. Paired with an automatic transmission, the engine is derated to 238 horsepower, with mechanics all 260 horsepower. But mechanics are rare, and more often paired with a 2.5 liter post-styled naturally aspirated engine. There are rumors about Chapovka up to 270 to 290 horsepower, but the question arises, will the automatic transmission withstand such a load? Fuel economy, the appetite of the CX-7 is excellent, rarely anyone manages to keep within 16 liters in the city in a calm mode. On the highway, too, less than 10 to 12 liters will not work. Therefore, it is quite logical that many owners began to convert their cars to gas. HBO on the Mazda CX-7 is not cheap from $1,000. Most often it is BRC or Zavali, cheaper equipment refuses to work correctly due to the fuel injection features of the model. With a quality installation, the owners do not note problems with the operation of the Mazda CX-7 with LPG, saving money on fuel in the region of 30 to 40%. 
the minimum gas consumption in the city is 15 liters of gas and 2 to 3 liters of gasoline per 100 kilometers gasoline is used to cool the fuel injectors. Gearbox and all-wheel drive you won't have to think long about choosing the type of gearbox for the Mazda CX-7. There are only three possible options. 1. Rare mechanics for 6 steps. 2. The Japanese Aizen 6-speed automatic is installed on the vast majority of CX-7s. 3. After restyling, paired with a 2.5-liter naturally aspirated engine, a 5-speed automatic transmission was installed. All boxes are very reliable, but with runs of more than 200,000 kilometers, natural wear and tear has not been canceled. Before buying, be sure to check the condition of the oil on the dipstick. Black color and a burnt smell are a reason to abandon the car or significantly bring down the price. There should also be no jerks when switching. In good condition, the automatic switches smoothly and imperceptibly. According to the official Mazda maintenance schedule, an automatic transmission oil change is not provided. But to significantly extend the life of the automatic transmission, it is recommended to make a partial oil change every 60,000 runs. Just be careful when choosing the type of oil. It is not uncommon for even official dealers to fill in the wrong Mazda MV or Mercon 5 oil. For a 6-speed Eisen automatic transmission, you need JWS3309 approval. Toyota T4 oil is optimal for price and availability. The weak point of the Mazda CX-7 all-wheel drive system is both gearboxes. The problem, however, is not global, but requires constant attention. They are constantly flowing, especially the front. Replacing oil seals helps for a short time. If, when replacing the seals, all the joints of the two halves of the gearbox are lubricated with sealant, then this period can be extended twice. But everything is in order with reliability, they fail only with a significant leakage of transmission oil. After restyling, the leakage problem was fixed. During normal driving, the Mazda CX-7 is front-wheel drive, only when slipping, the rear is connected using a clutch. Permeability at a decent level, but without fanaticism. In winter, high ground clearance and four-wheel drive add confidence on the road. When overheated, the clutch will automatically disengage. All CX-7s with 2.5-liter petrol engines were front-wheel drive only. Without all-wheel drive, 2.3 turbos are also found, only from the American market. Suspension Mazda CX-7 the running gear holds up our roads pretty well, but does it tough? After restyling, Mazda engineers reconfigured the suspension and it became noticeably more comfortable. Relative stiffness and excellent handling match the sporting spirit of the CX-7. The ball bearing of the lower arm of the front suspension dies before the silent blocks, and it only changes as an assembly. The Culebins know how to repress it, so there is a loophole toward saving. Rear wheel bearings are almost in the consumable category, they are rarely enough for more than 60,000 runs. But shock absorbers regularly serve 100 to 150,000 kilometers. The front shock absorber mounts sin with extraneous sounds, squeaks, and rattling. And replacing with new ones solves the problem for a short time. Craftsmen learned how to make special plastic spacers. It's cheaper than a replacement and lasts a long time. Handling and brakes Mazda is controlled clearly and in a sporty way, and this node usually does not bring problems. Even tie rods and tips are unlikely to have to be changed more than once every 100,000 runs. Power steering and steering rack regularly serve up to 200,000 kilometers, after which restoration may be necessary. The cost for such work is within reasonable limits, $100 to $200. The brakes are a little worse. They brake perfectly, there are no questions. But overheating often leads the brake discs. And it is not necessary for this to drive into a puddle on hot brakes. After restyling, heat dissipation was improved and the problem was gone. Therefore, today it is no longer relevant. Unless the previous owner put cheap analogs. If during braking you feel a beating in the steering wheel, then knock down the discount on the purchase of a set of brake discs. Minor flaws misted headlights for the Mazda CX-7 are normal. This disadvantage is best eliminated, otherwise there is a risk of failure of the Xenon Ignition Unit. 
This can be done with the help of two additional ventilation holes and vent tubes. The tubes must be with a filter element inside to prevent dirt from getting inside the headlight. Look for detailed instructions on the Mazdavod forums. In rear lights, from constant heat, landing bases for light bulbs often melt. It is better to install LED lamps in advance to prevent the problem from occurring. Lambda probe or oxygen sensor is not particularly durable. Signs of failure. Loss of traction. Abundant white smoke from the exhaust pipe. Increased consumption of gasoline. Treated only by replacement. Outcome the Mazda CX-7 is enjoyable in many ways. Appearance, space, dynamics, rich equipment. And all this stuff is offered on the secondary market for little money. But do not buy this car with the last money. Definitely need a margin of safety. If you manage to find a well-groomed copy with the right service, then you can drive 50 to 100,000 kilometers and enjoy a successful purchase. In other cases, the Mazda CX-7 can become a beautiful burden. A separate case is the CX-7 after restyling. The manufacturer has eliminated many flaws, but the price tag for such cars is no longer so tempting. Therefore, if you are a fan of the model, then it is better to overpay and choose a car from 2010. Such a Mazda will be easier to find in good condition, plus you will get rid of many generic diseases.